Lord of Ladies, my name is JackSepticEye and welcome to Portal 2! I said I was thinking about playing it after we did Portal 1 and I... You know what, the more I thought about it, the more I just really, really, really wanted to play this game. It's been... I've played it once, and only once, the time that it actually came out. The time that it came out, I played it back then, I haven't played it since. So, I'm very interested to see it all again. I can't remember a vast majority of the game, just like Cave Johnson, the stuff with GLaDOS, and um, some stuff towards the end and how it actually ends, but let's just get in and do it. Continue game. I don't have a continue game. No, sir. Uh, yes. I think. Maybe I do have a continue from years and years ago, but I didn't even play this on PC. I played this, the last, the first Portal game, the last, the series I just did was the first time I ever played it on PC, and now same with this. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. Okay. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Have a ceiling, Titty! Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. The gymnastic portion. <laughs> there is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. Okay, so he said that we've been in stasis for 50 years. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. <laughs> I'm appreciating art! You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. <laughs> God, it's so good. good. Now, please return to your bed. Okay, I will. Wait, I need to turn on uh, subtitles for you, though. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. Hello? Anyone in there? Hello? Hi? Wheatley? Are you Pat? Ah! Dog, dog. You look um good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? How are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay calm. Prepare. <laughs> it's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right? Is it? Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Okay. God, I love Wheatley. He's voiced by Stephen Merchant, who's one of my favorite comedians. And all right down there. Can you hear me? Hello? Yeah, all good. Am I talking to the ceiling, Titty? Wheatus! Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. <laughs> but don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. <laughs> do you understand what I'm saying? Yes. At all, does any of this make any sense? Just tell me, just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you, just, you just jumped, but never mind. Say apple, apple. <laughs> okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. <laughs> All reactor core My safeguards God. are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Uh oh. Okay, Quick! Look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, oh, but I'm baby. in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You're still holding on. This is so cool. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subject. Uh huh. Hold Jesus! On. This is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about Jesus. the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? I've got enough space. I uh, no. Uh, just, just got to get through here. Yikes! I just got to concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? <laughs> All right, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Oh, 
OK, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. OK, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. All right. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. I'm hold on. Good news. God damn. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. <laughs> There. Remember, Jesus, the physics are unreal. Holes. Not bullet holes, but don't worry, you'll figure it out. Okay. Seriously, do hold on this time. Yikeroo! There we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um, at least you're a good jumper. So you got that <laughs> little jumping on your side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Cool, man. Like when I played right. this. Off you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. When I played this the first time, and you saw those physics like oh, crumble and march on through that hole. crush, and you saw the walls disintegrate and everything. That was phenomenal. Yeah, it still holds up ahead. so That's well. Good luck. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. You recognize However, the room? Thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Ah, there's that familiar sight. Hey, it's me! What's up, Shell? How's it going? Looking very good for someone who's been in stasis for uh, a very long time, but we'll get to that in a second. So this is the room that you start the first portal game in, so... I just love those throwbacks. God, this game still looks amazing. Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. Yes. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. <laughs> <laughs> All right, take me up. All of that stuff about material gates and everything, we know that already. We're smart brains. We did it once before, we'll do it again. Uh, so this game is a lot longer than the first Portal game, obviously. The other if one is an hour and a half. Down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. <laughs> Jesus. This game's so goddamn funny. It gets even funnier and funnier as it goes along. Such really phenomenal writing. And this looks sensational. The nature versus the, uh, the aperture lab. It's really cool. Anyway. Ooh. Alright. Thank you for this. Very nice. Come on, Mr. Kube. Can I... Can I break this? God, look at that... Refraction of the glass. Very impressive. In we go. On we drop. And away we go. Very nice. Very good. It needs to teach me how to use portals again because it's been a long because time. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. You're <laughs> great. Uh, one thing I don't like about this game though is how many loading screens are in it. Every time you finish one of these you have to go through a loading screen. If the Earth it's is not that slow, but the manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body <coughs> that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to reason. Nice. We're being ruled by giant turrets. Are you still there? 
I the love hell? these environments. Hi! There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. Oh. Okay. Hello? Can you see the portal gun? No! Also, are you alive? <laughs> That's important. Should have asked that first. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll, wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come <laughs> back. And assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right, brilliant. Go team. See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. How is Stephen Merchant so funny? How? It's unfair how funny he is. Oh, I do see the portal gun, Stephen. Right. So, I'll. Pr that's me protecting the cube. And killing anybody that gets close because I love the cube so much. Also, I have a portal for a head. Am I understanding that correctly? Probably not. Okay, all praise portal gun and me. Uh, and GLaDOS gave me a cake and a cube. She didn't give me the cake though. Twas a lie, as they say. Oh, I forgot I could do this. Oh god, how do I- how do I- how do I back out of that? Hello? I don't know how I back out of this. What button did I press? No buttons are working. Uh oh. I fixed it. I had to restart the entire game, but no more gestures on the screen. I don't know why it's an older game. Maybe it's buggy. Who knows? Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robotics to share. Good. Wow. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note <laughs> it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. It's so fun! There's so much personality and so much, like, lore and everything kind of going on. Because as you go through it, you're like, wait, why is everything destroyed? Where am I? Because he says you're in stasis for 50 days, and then he says you're in stasis for nine, 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 nine so he breaks. This so, next test is very how dangerous. long? To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. <laughs> Lovely! Very nice! Oh, I was enjoying that. Thank you. I feel much calmer than I did. Okay, there's one block. Uh, and then two block down here. Look at me go! Look at my big smarty brain! Great work. Thank you! Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Oh. Oh, so what you mean? Compliment me. I need it. I've been trapped in stasis for a long time. Unreason? Okay, I don't know what any of these ones are. <gasps> beans! I miss the beans. I don't I don't care if the cake is real or not. All I care about is beans. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, what? please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. God, I really love the dilapidated scenes. It's so cool to look at. Uh, okay, can I just... Can't shoot any here. Oh. Whee! Here I am! Fuck you like a hurricane! Alright, what are we getting? That is not where I thought you'd be, but welcome, friend! Alright, that does that. Cool. And then another one's gonna come out through here. Or think. Oh. Well, I'm gonna get down there! Catch! Ah, yes! I'm a legend! And... Splunk! Well done. 
The Enrichment Center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All amateur oh. science personality <laughs> constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. I, I just had to put up the thing, but I decided that I was going to get myself into the game. I was going to send me in, coach! If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. <laughs> Wee -hee -hee! Oh, it's good to be back, baby. It's good to be feeling it once more. All right, we got to put our block down through, though. Are you ready, Blocky? Wait, hold on. Go, Blocky, go! Yeah, beautiful bastard. Wee! And here I also am. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future, and the future starts with you. Yes, yes, very good. Ooh, wee! <laughs> oh, you thought we were doing some momentum stuff in Portal One? Nah, bruh. It's about to get so. Uh, it's about to get wild and wacky out here. Bye, Blocky. Well, God damn it, Blocky. All right, how about we try this again, shall we? Huh? Nice. No, no. My God. Wee. I don't know why that bounced. Whatever. Okay, let's do it again. Woohoo! Woo oh God! <laughs> nice. Good work getting this far. Thank you. Fire. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, <laughs> or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. <laughs> All safety devices have been disabled. The enrichment center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Hey! Hi! Hey! I'm up here! I see oh, you! brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Oh, the, do you know what? It just goes to show, people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? <laughs> Brave. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're out of options here, so get ready to catch me. All right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. Okay. On three. Ready? I One. got you, buddy. Two. Leap of faith! Three. That's high. It's, it's <laughs> too high. Isn't it really that? All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me, catch me, catch me! I, I, I tried! Ow. Ow. Hi. Sorry. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. No. <laughs> oh. Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Will I? Is this a um, sexual thing? Yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. <laughs> Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Can you just turn around for a second? God, I forgot how funny this was. All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. Try right open while your back was turned. Pick me up and off we go. This shit is so awesome. The levels behind the levels. Look at this! No rail to tell us where to go! Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just hold on though, where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, <laughs> let me just get my bearings. Um just follow the rail actually. Oh, oh. No. Yes, hello, no, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact, whatever you do. No, thanks, we're good. <laughs> Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. Oh Hello. That's so sad. <gasps> he's different! No! He's a good one! I don't want to leave him here! Wheatley! You're an absolute chat! Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. Okay, Chadley. In order to escape, we're gonna to have to go through her chamber. And she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. If you want to just call it quits, and we could just sit here forever. That's an option. Option A, sit here, do nothing. Option B, go through there, and if she's alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. Ah, she tried once before. We'll okay, see what I'm happens. I'm gonna leave the cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't, don't go in there. She, she's off. She's yes. off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. This is the same. Is this the same place that I fought her? No, it's not. Oh, she's so cool. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. 
Do you know who ended up? Uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not going to believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. Wild. This human escaped, and uh, nobody's seen him since. Crazy. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened, and then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch me. <laughs> oh, don't worry. We'll be okay, back. Down these stairs. Jump. This, actually, look at it. That is quite a. Uh, Whee! Oh, still held. Still being held. You did, that's a great job. You've applied the grit. We're all fine. That's tremendous. I'm not actually holding on to you. It's more the gun that's doing anything, and I'm not allowed to drop you even if I wanted to. Kind of want to, but ah, I won't. Just, sorry, I just looked down. Oh, I God! Ah, oh, I've just done it again. <laughs> this is the main breaker room. Let's go in. So cool. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't even, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something, it doesn't say escape pod. Well, look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand? Yes. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, no. Tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. Good idea. Good idea. Also, these subtitles block like well, half the screen light. sometimes. That's, uh... God is quoting God. <laughs> <laughs> Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. No. Uh-oh. Escape pod. Escape oh, no, I pod. turned on the thing again! It's, it's moving up. Shit! Okay. Okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. This should you, slow it down. You've got it! No, it makes it go faster. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, oh, indeed. Initiated. Okay, don't panic! Alright, stop panicking. I uh, can't get rid of this thing! Um... Oh, there's a, there's a password. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just hack it. Not a problem. Uh, Weedus? A, 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 A. Weedlum? Um, S. Chadley? Okay. A, 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 C. Uh, she's alive now. I don't, okay, 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 listen. All right, new plan. Act natural, act natural. Done nothing. Hello? Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Uh, yeah, it was kind of me. Oh, God! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, no, 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 no! Yeah. Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. <laughs> but I think we can put our differences behind us. For science. Monster. <laughs> I love that line. God, I wish you could get rid of this I thing in the middle of the screen. Though, but since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. Oh. She killed Chadley. I'm okay, I think. Oh, mama. Superhero landing. The incinerator room. Be careful oh. not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. <laughs> the dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old times. Oh no, is he gonna die? I'll save you. Yes. Yes! Friend! Buddy! I saved you! No! Ah! I found it! Thanks. Thanks. There. Good. You have a dual portal device. Sure there do. Should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Can I Oh, oh, that's so weird. That's so strange to do. <laughs> Anyway, where are we going? Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This mm. will be our only chance to talk. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. Damn! In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, no. forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. 
Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. <laughs> more or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. But the important thing is you're back. With me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. No. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. <laughs> Reanimating the dead, maybe. <laughs> all right, Gladl. About the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh, good. That's back online. <laughs> I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this <laughs> first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Great. Great. Loving it. Absolutely loving it. Where do I put... Oh, right here. I did it, Gladl! Are, are you proud of me? Wait, hold on. We, uh... Let's do this first. I'll stand on it. And then, and then, and... And then! Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. Thank you. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. That's a lot of work that goes into one tiny laser that I just did. Jeez. So now we get back into actual testing stuff. Because now GLaDOS is back on... On top form! This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. <laughs> there should be one in the corner. I see it. Can I have it? Um, alright, you go over here. Neat! Easy, simple, nice and handy. <gasps> I also forgot that this is the game where you get the, um... The gels. So we'll get like <clears throat> we'll get the blue and orange gels. Well done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. <laughs> That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even <coughs> testing for that. <laughs> well, I'm glad I passed the flying colors. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. <laughs> Jesus. Thanks, Mom! Okay, that did that. So I love this! Everything's just falling apart and the rooms are like getting back together. Uh, ow! As you're flying through them and... Alright, where am I actually going? I should go up here first. Hi everybody, it's me. And a uh, huh! All right, that's one. And then we'll take you and put you huh, Congratulations. there. Congratulations, not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. <laughs> That's mean, okay? It's hard in isolation. Alright, I'm not going to say an exercise as much as I want to. I've been trapped here for a while. Feels like a million years. Oh, hi fellas. One moment. Come I'm on, GLaDOS. I'm these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. It's really cool when everything's destroyed and it puts it back in a somewhat normal manner. And this really, I mean, you got to see it a little bit in Portal 1, but you really see the inner workings of how these things are put together in this game. Oh, I can't go in. With all of these pneumatic hydraulic arms behind it all. So it shows that because all the rooms are like boxes, that they're all basically just put together however they want in any sort of shape or form that they want. It's really cool. We also saw at the start of the game all the other sort of enrichment center candidates, all of their pods and all their little cube rooms as well as mine, but I'm the only one who's left alive. <clears throat> wow. Someone's making noise over there. What is it?
All right. Will this stop if I just do this? It surely will, Lee. Away we go. What is this? Hey! Come on, Chumley. Away we go. Um, I, yeah. Nice. Okay. Oh, okay, just let it go again. There you go. There you go. There you go. Nice. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Shut up, GLaDOS. Me be big smartly up in brain. What you got, Gladman? I got this. I'm a smarty. Okay. God, I wish cleaning my house is that easy. Just push everything this out of the way. Test involves the aperture science aerial thing. Yes! It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Whee! I did it, GLaDOS! Woohoo! God, I love these! There's gonna be some puzzles later on where you tie a bunch of those together. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, <laughs> and pump it back in. <laughs> so you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. It is very interesting. It's like being on a plane where you're breathing in everybody else's farts all the time. Yummy! Yum, yum, yummy. See, I told you, there's so many loading screens in this game. Oh, advanced aerial faceplates. Yo, well, mess me I'm up. Well, through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. <laughs> oh, come on, GLaDOS. It's not that bad. Whee! Hey! Ho-ho! Oh, I'm a legend! Oh, right as we go! Nice! That was so fun! Sweet! Alright, where is this coming oh, down? sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. That's a lot of it! Okay, do I need any of this? Uh, nah. That's a nice chair here, though. You don't have to test with the garbage. And a gigantic CD. Press the button again. Okay, give me a cube this time. Yay! Thanks, Glados. You know she's really not that bad. I love how this game also doesn't have like one or two additions. It's not like, oh, this is portals, but now slightly different. This is. They added so much more to this game. Um, where is the bouton? Le bouton, le bouton. Whee! Nice. Excellent. Good Remember job, me. Thanks, me. Talking about smelly garbage standing around being <laughs> useless. <laughs> That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. Shocking! And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. <laughs> which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second <laughs> time just now. It's okay, GLaDOS. I've been called much worse! And I'll be called much worse again. <clears throat> but it's fine. I am garbage. Thank you, GLaDOS. I, I appreciate your belief in me. Guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noise. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. <laughs> it's oh, so good. Did hey! I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test. I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. For Wait, oh. Oh, companion cube, you're back. Oh. No, I fizzled that one too. Oh well, we have warehouses full of the things. No! Absolutely worthless. I'm they're, happy to get rid of them. They're not worthless, they're my friends! Whee! Alrighty then, um... Let me just grab my cube friend here. Thank you. I'm just gonna put you up here. 
before I get there, because I feel like that that's 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 probably better for for everybody, you know. Um, all right, we. <laughs> Nope, nope, get on there! Get on there, Cubass! And I will do. Huh! Yahoo! Every test chamber is equipped with an <coughs> emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. Oh, I'm gonna take something with me. I'm gonna take my buddy old pal here. Yes. Let's go. Let's be together forever. Yes. Come on, Cube. Come on. We get to do it finally. No, oh, dicks. I think that one was about to say, I love you. They are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. That is so mean. I'm gonna beat you, GLaDOS. Uh, beaches this next in the ground. Test involves emancipation grills. Well, Remember, I told you about them in the last test area. You they sure did. All right, so I need to go in. Whoa, that works really well. Um, Thank you. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. <laughs> there. If you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. She's such a fecker. She's such a stinky fecker. She knows what she's doing. What a stink! Alright, but I solved it. It's not that hard, GLaDOS. Come on. Give me something harder! Me being big manly brain up in the head hole! Oh, what is going on here? Oh! Should I stand on it? Oh, you really hate that wall. Let me stand on it! I want you to hate me as much as you hate that wall! Damn it! It won't let me- <laughs> Hi! Well, I'm back. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? No. There. Try it now. What happened, right? I was just lying there. You thought I was. <laughs> mm, this plate must I be celebrated to someone of your generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Thank you. Try it now. Right? Couldn't believe it either. <laughs> you seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. <coughs> oh. Really? Dang. Wee! Easy. What do we got going on over here? A bunch of stinks? Yeah, seems likely. Which is the best way to go about doing this? Uh, keep the orange there, and then do this. This'll work. Woohoo! I miss Wheatley! I wanna talk to him again. No, that's not really gonna work now, is it? Because I need it- I needed to do that. Needed to be the other one to open up the button to get the- Yep! Yep, yep, let's just do this again. Never mind, my brain's still smart. My brain's still big. Still big smart brain. Just, it's just taken a while to get up to full gear. Taking a full while to get up to full speed. Whee! Ow! <laughs> well, I have a small brain now because I just crushed it. Where does that need to go? Ooh, right there. Quite simple really, isn't it? Um, then how about we do you there? And you there. Easy. Easy. Look at you, sailing through the air majestically. I know. Like an eagle, piloting a blimp. <laughs> I get it. I've put on a little weight. Leave me alone. God damn it, GLaDOS. I'm self-conscious. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Aww. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, 
Maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. No, you won't. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. No, you won't. You suck. You never do nice things for me. Ever. Uh, can I get out over there? Yeah. Chia, chia. Whee. Whee. Thank you for the blocky. Um. Oh. That actually works out really well. Uh, let's do something. I'm trying to figure out where the block is actually needed. Alright, well, let's just do this for now. No. <laughs> well, you want to go again? Hell yeah, that was awesome! Alright, okay. Whee! Block you off. Alright, got it, got it, getting it, got it. So we need to come out, hit that, then go and hit that, and then we end up above. Gotcha. But how? Oh! Oh! Just like that. Turns out it wasn't that hard. At least that still works. Woohoo! Come to me! Oh! Okay, careful. Um, I can't move this beam, though. Can I? Is there a separate beam? I don't think so, Stinky. I don't stink so. Oh! 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 I get it. Wait, no. I'm- Oh, oh Jesus. Shave my mustache a second on that one. Whee! We have to do this. Okay, not exactly that. <laughs> you take this one. And then you take this one. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You seeing it? Are you putting it together in your head? Woo! Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Now a test! I was kinda hoping you'd go on your own. Whee! 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 <laughs> awesome! Well, you passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. No. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. What did they look like? Did they have faces? That does sound like a human. What's up next? What are you gonna test my toes with now? Eleven. One one. Double first. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. <laughs> if you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. Oh. It would also set your hair on fire. Oh. You don't actually do it. Bit late. Kinda already did. All right. Catch me. Catch me. Catch me. Catch me. Whoo. That was scary. Um. Oh. <laughs> C'est génial! Huh. Nice. And then, huh. Not. Nice! Huh. I got you, buddy, don't worry. And now, how do I get over there? Just like this. Yeah! Uh, the brain. It is a wonderful thing. Excellent. You're a predator, and these tests are your prey. Speaking of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? <laughs> Did you guess sharks? Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. <laughs> nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. <laughs> oh, great. I, I love these behind-the-scenes sort of things as well. She is actually taking light and beaming it down. And then it turns into these hard light bridges. So cool. And then all the Valve stuff after this game was displayed in this sort of little mini diorama format. When you start up your HTC Vive or your Valve Index the first time, the little setup mode has these little guys in it and they come over and they stand next to you and you get to see how big they are. It's really cool. Also, there was a chunky turret in here. 
Um, the door's malfunctioning. I guess somebody's going to have to repair that too. No, don't get up. I'll be right back. Don't <laughs> touch anything. I'll touch it all. Can I get through? Hey, hey, I'm here. Weightless. Some bird eggs up here. Just dropped me to the door mechanism. Shut it right down. I, ah, okay. Bird, 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 bird. <laughs> okay. That's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. Livid. Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break out of here, all right? Very soon, I promise, I promise. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes. Keep te Just keep testing. Remember, you never saw me. Never saw me. So fun. Love this effect I in the window. I with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be, well, living anymore. Anyway, back to testing. She killed the little doorman? That's really mean. Whoa. Okay. Uh, righty ho ho. Oh! <laughs> I thought it would come out under me as well. I didn't. Oh, Blinky. <laughs> Small setback. Anyway, back to testing. Uh huh. Uh huh. Just, just, just do it like this. That, that's what I meant to do the first time. Works out really well. Now I need to get this. Come along, Blockus. Now, how do we get you over there? Uh, that is our question, isn't it? Yes. Um, what if we... Just do a little thing like that? Pretty good, huh? I reckon. I think so. Um... Not really sure where to go after this, though. Oh god, don't go through it. Um, what about here? Okay, working out really well. Good job. Um, we're doing well. Could be doing better, though. Actually, it's quite easy now that I think about it, because all I have to really do is, like, that. And then go through here. <laughs> Shush. I don't hear any of it. All well right. Done. In fact, you did so well. I'm going to note this on your file. Woo! 360. In the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. I'll take it, man. I'm not here to be the best student. I'm just here to pass the tests and have fun. This next test involves turrets. You remember them, right? I They're do. spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, that's you in five seconds. Good luck. <laughs> Little spherical thing full of bullets. <laughs> I love that you actually get to see them being put together. It's just a robot crammed full of bullets. Alright, well, I'm gonna leave this first episode of Portal 2 here. What a way to kick it all off. Sadly, that is all the time I have. Um, and some of the technical issues kind of ran me out of time as well. But I'm really glad to be playing this. It's so funny. It's, it's even funnier than I remember. I think I appreciate the humor even more now than when the game came out. Um, it, the writing is just so phenomenal. The only thing that still bugs me is all of these loading screens. It would be cool if there was an update with better technology, but it's just the engine is so old by now that they had to load each individual thing. And at the time, this was a lot of moving parts. This was a lot of physics. It was a lot of... Like, really nice lighting going on, a lot of stuff to take in, or put in place, so... It was a lot to render, I just wish that there was an update to get rid of all these loading times, because every chamber basically has a loading screen after it, but... It's not enough to sully the experience, but... If you've never seen Portal 2 before... First of all, I hope you're liking it, smash like if you are, but also, I... There's a lot of really terrific storytelling coming in this series. It's such a phenomenal game. And the way it takes this concept and actually builds out a full, like, heartfelt story out of it and does so much more with it than the first game is really, really top quality stuff. So, look forward to that. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to keep up to date with all the Portal 2 stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next one.